it's like, it's like a dream. Honestly, it's like a dream come true in there. Alright guys, so it got a really busy in there. I don't know what happened, but there were just people everywhere and I don't ever want to make people feel uncomfortable shopping because usually, you know, people come in and they kind of know what they're looking for and I just don't want to be constantly in their way trying to like film a section. I know that you guys understand that. So I thought, let me also share with you what I got. It's a huge haul, so, and it's a shocking haul. So hopefully you like this video. All right, I found some awesome new diffusers. What in the world? Okay, so it comes with the oil and then the sticks that would go into the diffuser. And it's just going to fragrance any room. And this one is peach. Also loving the packaging as well, you guys. This is beautiful. I've never seen Dollar Tree do anything like this. This one is a coconut. Here's an orchid, garden rain, fresh cut rose, and sage and citrus. I did pick out these two bags. They're very cute, very summery, even a little bit of spring, but whenever I think of summer, I think of pineapples and flamingos, not necessarily springtime, but that's just me. But they are lovely little tote bag so I'm excited about those I did pick up some of the scarves and I don't normally pick up scarves but I thought the the patterns on here were just too nice to pass up and I thought that I could definitely do something with my planner and just kind of tie a little bit of the scarf on the a5 you know just for like a charm effect uh, or just find some way to use this as a decor. I also picked up the cactus one. I love the colors and the black stripes. This is probably one of the most interesting prints they've ever done on a scarf, to be honest. And then I got this fun drinky one. This would be really cute on a summer straw bag or those bags that are really trendy uh, what are they called? I don't know, but I'll insert a picture for you guys. This would be perfect, in my opinion. This cute little scarf. You could even add the other ones. The fish will... Yes, that is what I'm going to do with the fish one. I'm going to add it to a cute str straw bag for the summertime. The next things, I am so shocked because I purchased these at Walmart and the wild basil with the lime was one of my favorite soaps I ever found at Walmart and I found them at Dollar Tree. So I don't know that there's a huge price difference. It may even have been cheaper at Walmart, like 99 cents. I'm not sure, but either way, these for a dollar is a great deal. And then I picked up the Peony and Plum. I've never tried this one. It is the Soft Soap brand. And again, here is the Wild Basil. Even the packaging is really pretty. I did pick up those fashion pins. They are some of the cutest, loveliest little fashion pins I've ever seen a Dollar Tree carry. They by far have been my favorite patterns out of the bunch, especially this one. This one's my favorite. I also picked up, I did get the serum, and I think that I, I purchased another serum. I'm pretty, did I pick one that had red? on it or I may even have already got this one but they did have two different serums and so I picked this one up and I was really shocked to find the Amazon mention on their packaging so I'm definitely gonna have to incorporate this into the video where I'm gonna be trying Dollar Tree Beauty bath spa products for a whole week so stay tuned for that if that is of any interest to you i'm going to be trying a bunch of products for a week and then i'm going to compile it all into a video and do one whole video where i talk about what products seem to work what products i liked and didn't like so it'll kind of be my first huge dollar tree review and i found some new highlighters i'm going to also include this in that beauty portion of the video and these are the two colors that i found and I picked up some more baskets. I need one for the upstairs uh, game room bathroom. That 
that trash can went to hell in a handbasket. No pun intended. And then I got another black one for my office. All right. Next up, you saw that I did grab this sprinkles. I thought this was really shocking for a dollar. And it's, I definitely want to bake soon. So, and I did get, I, I lost control. If you ever see me at Dollar Tree and you see me grab for these, take them out of my cart and put them back up. And then come check my cart again in 15 minutes because I most likely went back around and put them back in my cart. So I got my uh, Star Mix Favorites, which just has a bunch of the most popular Haribo, Haribos. They have the Coca-Cola, the cherries, all of those. And then I got Happy Hoppers, which is their Easter version. And this, the flavors and this gummy bear. Also, I picked up some wild cards. I picked up these little what, wild animals. They're just little plastic boop, boop, boop. But what I love about them, I just thought of Christmas time. So I'm definitely gonna do a DIY with these. I love the rustic, you know, aspect of the bear and this elk. If this is an elk, I don't know exactly what he is uh but i thought you know christmas bathroom decor maybe or something so yeah hold on let me check my phone someone be, t be texting me my daughter and i found ta -da, some new wall decals oh look how pretty this one is with the tiger and he has like little snapchat flower crown i love this also like a golden girls vibe whenever i see those palm leaves i just i'm gonna think of golden girls i got the sports one not really sure but i got it and i found this narwhal one with the little like unicorn type of whale how pretty the little hearts are so gorgeous and then here's the other half that you could like put together on the whale if you are putting this on the wall and i did grab those two tablecloths because i saw dollar tree post on their instagram the the new maybe it's not new but they definitely posted on instagram recently on their summer collection of plates and party stuff. And so I got the turtle one. You can see that, just multiple colors, and then the starfish pattern. I'm waiting for the plates. I didn't get the bowls. We saw the bowls, or hopefully I was able to add that clip, but there was someone kind of interested in looking in that area, so I moved along. But I'm, I'm waiting for the plates to come out. And brand new picture frames. Dollar Tree, what are you doing to me? So this one has a gray theme and it says fam Faith, Family, Friends. And then you would just clip your picture there. And it has a burlap, burlapy look to it. The white one is my favorite. I just think it's the cleanest, looks the most expensive, all forever and always. And then this one's not my favorite. Uh, this weird terracotta, terracotta not terracotta, terracotta color. I do want to point out that they even have this little metal embellishment. Love that, like the nail look, really nice. But you could always spray paint these. So if you don't like those colors, you could always spray paint them the color of your choice. I did get the grad box. This one was one of my favorites. I don't know what happens when you flip it to the other side. I don't know if it says like 2019 and what color the sequins is on the other side. So we'll see. And the very last thing, I did pick up this picture frame. Put the little picture here and the tassels in the one. I really like that. All right, guys, I know I rushed through that, but that is my haul and my video for today. Thank you so much for coming along with me. Let me know in the comment sections if you prefer a shop with me or if you just prefer a sit down haul. Yes, I don't think I've ever asked you guys that question and I, I'm actually more curious than I realize to know what you guys prefer. So definitely comment down below. That's not to say I won't still do shop with me's. I do tend to favor sit down hauls. Uh, 
But yeah, let me know your thoughts. Thumbs up and I'll see you in my next one.